Good day again and welcome to our channel. This is Green Thumb Philippines. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I repot or replant this uprooted bougainvillea. Actually, this bougainvillea has been uprooted last uh, two days ago and I let it soak here in my reservoir of rainwater. And uh, as you can see, I have a little bit of uh, leaves that are attached over here. And for now, I'm going to replant this. Over here is my uh, bonsai pot around uh, four, in four inches in uh, height and my my, my uh, soil mix is this uh, at the bottom part is dried leaves and this is river sand uh, common garden soil uh, mixed with the uh, river sand because uh, river sand is a slightly acidic soil one of the uh, common uh, soil that I mix here in my bougainvillea garden or bougainvillea bonsai is uh, uh, garden soil and river sand and then one of my uh, best practices here in uh, my place in my garden every time I replant or repot a uh, flower or a plant I always uh, add this uh, Epsom salt so now I'm adding some here a uh, rainwater again slightly acidic again because bougainvillea love a slightly acidic soil or soil mix and uh, as you know our rainwater here in the philippines or here in my place is a uh, slightly acidic and for now i'm going to put this uh, bougainvillea at the shaded part in our uh, garden over here and after one month i'm going to check the progress if, uh, what is the result as you can see over here is my uh, my a uh, little bit collection of aroids and uh, philodendron and then after one month i checked the progress of our uh, our replanting so as you can see we have a good result and uh, the new buds are coming out so uh, this is how i replant my uh, uprooted bougainvillea so over here we have a lot of stems and buds that are going out so they are so healthy and uh, for this time i'm going to put it at the open sun so uh, this bougainvillea will produce a lot of flowers for me so this is how, how i uh, repot my bougainvillea thank you for watching bye bye and i love you all thank you